comes, that's the only way. Hey everybody, we're back with another session from the weekend after Christmas where we had 120 players come out for a weekend of skirmishes. And it was about as crazy as you'd expect. We're going to pick right up with our first game where it's a traditional capture the flag but with a twist. Each team has one demo man and only the demo man can lower the other team's flag to win. Up on the hill. Yeah, I see. Oh, hit! Did I just get friendly fired? No, it came from up there. She can get behind me right here. Just kneel down right behind me. Get, by, get down, get down behind oh. me. Get down behind me. Thanks, bud. Logan. The flag is right there, but you know there's somebody on it. Oh, come on, dude. Can you lay some fire on that guy? Hit! Hit! Yeah, I'm gonna have to go back and look at my footage, but I'm 99% sure I blasted the hell out of a guy who didn't call it. Unfortunately, that's part of the game, and you can't get mad about it, or you're not ever gonna have any fun. So have you ever had that thing happen where you're shooting on semi and you're pulling the trigger just a hair faster than the motor will turn and you lock it up? Then you gotta flip it over to full auto, fire a few times, and then switch it back to semi to get it to work again. Yeah, that's about to happen at the most inopportune time. Hit! God damn, a gun jam. I had that whole pocket of guys, man. It was a bittersweet ending, but at least while I was engaged with those guys, the rest of our team did get their flag down for a victory. Oh, there he is. He's way back there. Wow. I had that whole pocket of guys, man. My yeah, gun. there was like three of them alive. The final game mode of the day was a small field skirmish, where the objective is to control the house in the center of the field. And with 120 people in a relatively small area, it was pretty much yeah, raining cool. BBs. And I have to admit, with so many people firing in such a small area, there were several times in this game where I think I shot people after they were already shot. Almost simultaneously, but really close. You got two people? I got two people. Good job. Got it out, house. Hit. He's hit. Dude, I hit you first, man. This is the objective though. <laughs> yeah, holding this building right here is the objective. Yeah. 
What's the, what's the situation? We're uh, holding down the fort. Well, mean you know where any of them are? Um, there's one in the woods over here. Oh, shit. That was one in the wall. Didn't look close to it. I There's nobody at the Jeep. Outhouse, outhouse. Oh, hit. I have no idea where that came from. Hey, we need some more guys over here. We need some more guys over here. Logan, take that spot I was in. Take that spot I was in. Gun hit! There's still a guy in this little house right here. He keeps taking pot shots, but I don't think he's got, he doesn't have the range. He doesn't have the range? Well, he hasn't shot anybody over here yet. He's been there the whole time. Oh, he hit me. Oh, he did? Yeah, I was sitting behind those bricks. Oh, did he? Oh, see, that guy's shooting at me, but he's dropping right up in here. Whoa, I'm hit. Good shot. What you doing? Looking. Get back into it. There's less than five minutes. They're going to rush. I'm while I'm out of range. So I can see there's one behind the outhouse. Yeah, but you just need to get up in place because they're going to rush. There's less than five minutes. So you can go fend off the last minute charge. It's coming. I'm stop. Here they come. Well, got those three guys. <laughs> so there you go guys, it was a really fun day. Although it definitely took me out of my element a little bit. I think my play style is probably best described as a steady flank. I really love to take wide routes around people and get that perfect angle. And with 120 people on a small field, that's just not going to happen. But we had a great time and we really hope you enjoyed the gameplay. If you haven't already, definitely join us on our airsoft journey by hitting that subscribe button. Leave us some comments and suggestions on how we can make better content for you guys, the viewers. And we'll see you next time.